Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. It's been an interesting time with a very beautiful band right here. And as you can see, in beautiful colors, they're even changing their costume, performance after performance. I don't know where they are from, but I know they are from this part of the world because it uh, looks like I have seen this kind of performance for a very long time. Very lovely and uh, energetic. But we need to know the secret behind it, though, as they are still very much right here. Uh, Ella, what are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. I can see you're fine. And your band members, right? They are all fine. Are you not fine? Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, kindly, kindly introduce yourself in a brief. My name is Dekinez Bola Lelata, popularly known as Bola Discovery. Popularly known as Bola Discovery. Please, are you from this state of Kwara? No. From where? Um, I'm from Abe Okuta, but relocated from Lagos to this place. From Lagos to this place. All right. What can you say about your band members now? Ah, they're amazing. I have an amazing crew. Um, yes, I have an amazing crew. They are supportive. They are, um, they are enduring. Um, they are caring and they are understanding. They're energetic and very willing to work with me at any time. Like today, we've had like five sessions. Yes, and um, they've been there. So they are amazing. I celebrate them. I celebrate them. I celebrate them. <laughs> All right, there's still a lot of things we are going to discuss right on this uh, platform. But before we go ahead, we call this Splendid on the platform of Moinet TV. I am Aila Kolaole, Abbas the Legend. Uh, for you to en enjoy much of this uh, interesting program, kindly subscribe to Moinet TV on YouTube, Instagram, even on Twitter. Our Terrestrial TV is coming very soon. A round of applause, everyone. Entertainment is life, and that's what makes life go round. You sing, you dance, you're a poet, you're a stand-up comedian, whatever you do as far as entertainment is concerned. This is one big platform for you to exhibit your talent, to showcase yourself to Sorosuke, if I may have to put it that way. We're talking about Splendid on Moinet TV. To enjoy more of our interesting programs, Kindly subscribe to Moinet TV on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. Very soon we are coming on Terrestrial TV just for the pleasure of you viewers and followers of Moinet TV. I am Maina Kolawole, Abbas, the legend. Well, might be too quick to let the cat out of the bag, but as you can see, I'm not the only one on the show. I have one big fish right here from a very large ocean. I'm talking about uh, Bola Discovery. Polar Discovery and our ministry, of course, I will leave that for us to, you know, talk more about it because I'm so interested. I think interest when I was standing right there for hours watching her perform and that's been so interesting. I'll be right back after this time. So when we're back, it's going to be polar. You're welcome back to the show. Splendid. Good afternoon, Bola Discovery. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Fine, thank you. But your voice is so cool now. Whenever you're on the microphone, you're always loud, energetic, and all that. Oh, yes, because that's performing. Okay. Now I'm talking. Now you're talking. So there's a clear difference. Yes. Can we say that's a talent? Uh, well, that, that's a skill. It's a skill. Yes. Um, when, you're, when you're singing, you have to let it out. Okay. But when you're talking, if you're shouting, people say you're lousy. Yes. So you have to be calm when you're talking. But when you are singing, you can't be calm. Because people must hear. It's a sound. You're producing sound. I know, I know you have it. So <laughs> let's, let's just start this way. Kindly introduce yourself. Okay. Um, my name is Vicky um, Bola Lelanoko, but popularly known as Bola Discovery. Um, I'm a nurse by profession. I'm a health educator. Uh, but presently, I work as a business development manager for Lear Group, for Lear Medical Center. Um, a subsidiary of Lear Group. Um, what else? Um, I'm a music <laughs> minister. And um, I love to sing. In fact, music is my life. Um, I love to sing, and I've been singing since I was very young. Since I was very young, but I could remember. 
uh, and um, thank God up to now we are still singing. Don't worry, you have a lot to say. Let's just continue. Let's be taking this thing one after the other because it's going to be one of our questions that uh, for how long has this journey started? Now you are telling us since when you were young. Can you talk about the age? Six. Okay, you were six until this moment. All right. Um, as a result of that, where do you intend to see Bola discover in the next five years? Um, to the glory of God, I see myself on a global platform. I see myself going far. I see myself affecting lives through the gifts God has given me. And um, I, I believe that God has started the work and it will take us further. Only him can. We can only say this is what we want to do, this is what we want to see ourselves. But only God can make things happen because he knows what is good for us. So I like to just impact lives through the music that I, the song that I sing, which is strictly gospel. Anyway, sometimes I could do an inspirational song, but um, my genre is gospel. gospel. So basically. I, basically, yes. So I want to touch lives, as many lives that I can touch okay. all over the world. I don't want to be limited to a particular place. You are seeking to prove that at the end of the day because we need a song, a special inspirational song, gospel song, wants our life to be touched and be shown okay. today. Yeah. Right? You, you, you know, talking about how far you've started, it's been a long time, but sometimes the road is the rough and tough. Definitely. Any experience about that? Ah, plenty of experience. Okay, maybe one of Ah, so many. Um, Presently, what we experience as a music minister, like gospel minister, I mean to say, okay. is such that um, when it comes to the finance, it's it's a big one. It's a big deal. It's a big challenge. It's a big one, yes. Um, because um, people don't feel that you should get money as a gospel singer. Mm. They believe it's a free gift and it should Render the service free. Forgotten the fact that you are not going to do this song alone. You have employed people to join you. Somebody, some people, are, some set of people are going to back you up to harmonize what you're doing. Yes. Some set of people are called musicians. They are going to be playing all kinds of instruments yes. to support what you're doing. Yeah. And they aren't going to do it free because some of them, that's what they live on. Yeah. So if God is calling you, that's your business. But if they are coming to support you, is their skill and they have to get paid. But most people, especially churches, when they invite you, they just feel that if you charge, you have committed sin. I don't charge, but I've come to learn something that what people what does not cost people something, they don't tend to appreciate it. They treat it anyhow because it has not cost them anything. So what I do recently is to tell them what it's going to cost me to come. Okay. okay. I'm not charging you. On business so business. I ask you, am I coming alone? If I'm coming alone, it's going to cost me my fuel. Yes. Pay for my fuel. Yeah. If you feel like giving me anything, fine. Okay. If you want me to come with my crew, I tell them how much I pay each person. Okay. So for you to see them appear in your program, it does not come free. Okay. So I have to pay them. So pay for my fuel. If it's outside, it's even better. If I'm invited outside, it's better. Because already they know. They can't come that far. And you'll be telling me, God bless me. God bless me will not pay me food. God bless me will not put me in a hotel. It's, it's, it's like um, there are a lot of food. things to say about this. It's a whole lot. So, know, But the finance lot. is it's very key. Because everything needs money. Definitely. For us to go to the studio, like what I've come to do here today, is a lot of money. It costs you a lot of money to do it. So that's why I've not gone into it full time because I have to work to support it. Okay. But now the way it is, I'm going into it full time because okay. the time is right. All right. All right. Yeah, that will take me to this question. At this level of polar discovery, you know, let me just link up with the issue of uh, the business aspect of that gospel music I have to put it because the fact that it's gospel, according to you, doesn't mean you can't get money from yeah. it. To make a living. All right. So don't you think it's high time you have your own kind of management team? I'm not even talking about the instrumentalist this time. Management team that will, they can't just contact you to that. Maybe go to your manager. 
Uh, yes, you know, like I said, I've not been doing water. So because I work, there are so many programs I've not been able to attend. Because sometimes it clutches with better management meeting, better there's this, there's that. You know, when you're working to someone, you're being paid. Okay. You must justify the payment. Yeah. Okay, so um, I have to retreat myself. So uh, that has not given me the uh, the privilege or the opportunity to not get a manager for what because I've not been not that I've not been busy but I've not been having time to get busy. So but now I've been busy. When I say I've been busy, it's been back to back for us. You can see okay. some of them are breaking down and all that. Yes. It's been back to back for us. So now I I I do have a manager. Okay. But I know that I have some people that you still have to relate with directly based on relationship. Yes. Because if you now say okay talk to my manager they're like oh <laughs> she can't talk to us again. <laughs> okay. So, uh, but my husband right. has been helping in that area. In that area. Yes. Yeah, so, aspects. when people, because we have our two numbers there. Okay. So, when you call, is that how you call my husband? My husband's number is the first. So, okay. people tend to call the number first. Okay. Uh, they tend to call the number first. All right. It's so, been an interesting time with Bola Discovery on the show. Splendid. Moine TV. If you enjoy more of our interesting programs, Kindly subscribe to Moina TV on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter. You call me live on Teresa TV. We'll be right back after you. All right, you're welcome back to the show. Um, we are still hanging out right here with a uh, lot discovery. Let me know about the challenges and all that. But no matter how tough and rough the journey is, there must be a particular day you are so happy in the situation. There's no day I'm not happy. Every day. Every day. Anytime I hold that microphone, it's my best day. Okay, so what's now your turn down? At least you're going to have turn up or turn down. Something you like, something you don't like. Uh, well, for me, the only discouraging part of it is when you get to a place, you have been invited to a program. When you get to a place, you realize that they were not even prepared. The sound is. <laughs> They're like, hello, excuse me, are they serious at all? You put a big banner, a big board and everything, and your son is as terrible as this. Then on a normal program, what, what's, what's the difference? So that sometimes puts me off because it's not good for the voice. It affects the performance. It affects the morale. Yes. But most times, God has been faithful. That even if the sound is bad, God will still help us to do what he wants us to do. And we do and leave. But you know, sometimes... All the musician I take may not be able to play because there's nowhere to plug in something. So sometimes it pisses me off. It, it, it pissed me off. Like, okay, you invited these people and you're not prepared. So that, but aside that, it's not money. Even if you don't give me money, the next time, no go come. Next time, no go come. If I come and all you do is you don't even bother, there's no problem. I'll not fight you. Okay. But when you call me next time, I tell you. Any any albums to your credit? You're working on one, you had ones, or you are not interested in all these albums? I do have albums. I have two. Two albums. Now. I have two albums, but I've, I've, is that, they are not, um, how do I put it? I've not put it to, or give it to any marketer to do anything okay. to it. But uh, people have it. Somehow, somehow, they just have it. Is that I go for programs and they request for albums and I, I give to them. What are their titles? The products. first one is Baby Is okay. okay. The other one is Yada. Baby is okay. Yada. Yada. Yes, that's the second one. Yada. Baby is okay is uh, number one. The okay. second, one, second one is Yada. Means lift up your voice in praise. Oh. Where does that come from? Yada. It, it's an Hebrew word. It's an Hebrew word. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. So far we have Baby okay. I hope we are not going to have Baby okay as the next album. And no, no, no. It's Eki that we have as next. Eki. Eki. I have a lot of singles. Uh, yeah, yeah, I have a lot of singles. So, okay. Eki, uh, Covenant Keeping God. Um, Is there any way we can download your songs? Ah. Because it's on my YouTube. Really it's on my YouTube channel. That's the only reliable source for now. Okay. I, it was on Boom. I don't know if it's still there. I, I, I will check. Okay. It was on Boom Play. It was on all those um, play stores. But, you know, when you contact people, Contract people to do stuff for you, and you know they don't take you seriously and all that. 
right? And like I said, I've not really been full time, so I, I, I hardly have time to follow. But well, you so, said now that you are going to be full time. Yes, okay, I am. So has From, it been in terms of challenges, you know, then because you talk about your husband now, you can you create then your career? Has it been challenging? It, it is. It, it, yes, it can be challenging. How? It can be challenging, but you know, having to balance things up. Okay, now I've been here for how many hours? Recording for a church yeah. abroad. Okay. So that's an invitation. You can't, you can't go there now. Yeah. So what they do is that they call you to record for them. I recorded for four days. That's four different days. Okay. So, um, and it's been coming like that. Now, sometimes when I get home, okay. I'm tired. And that's the time my children are coming back from school. I don't really have time to attend to them. So those are lapses. But sometimes, thank God, God just surrounded with people that would help. So what I do is anytime I'm not free, I dedicate those time to them to make up for the times I've not been around. I'm married to a man that is understanding. So sometimes we go together to all those programs. So if we are just coming back together now, you're not come and kill me to come and do it. You know that we are tired together. <laughs> <laughs> it's been an interesting time. Well, that's um, that. <laughs> polar discovery. And we're going to have her in the house next time. I hope when we invite you to the studio next time, she's going to come. Yes, if I want, I'll plan to do that. And we'd like to have you around uh, next time. So you have a lot of albums to record it, I believe. Yes. Um, and if by that time, I should have released the total. So, well, <laughs> and people are ready to download from all platforms. But they can visit my uh, my YouTube page, Bola Discovery. Okay. All songs are there. Bola Discovery. Yes, I just put them. All right. Say something about my studio. Uh, my studio for me, since I got to know about my studio, I've been using my studio. In fact, if they are going to rate the artists that uses this place, I should come. First. Yes, because I come here like like. On a constant basis, I come here every first. It's because there is something you see in my studio. I want to do this. Uh, well, I like the environment, number one. Okay. And um, it's easy to connect, whatever. <laughs> okay. Connect, yeah. Then the, the output at the end of the day is always very good. The output of whatever you're recording so is very good. My studio is just on top of the game. It's up, yes, it's, it's on top of the game because I've not seen any computer. Is on top of the game. It, the only thing is the timing. Okay. We can work on the timing. It, you know, timing so that if you are going live, you go live on time. But aside that, my studio is, is good. All right. It's, it's been it's an good. interesting time with uh, Bola Discovery and uh, International. Bola Discovery Music International. Music International. So quickly. Just uh, why don't the ministry? It's like you talked about something. Why is music relevant? And um, you are not lying down to. Yes, uh, I'm. I'm a. I'm a music minister, so I sing strictly gospel. Okay. But we are not limited to church. Okay. I I do wedding. Okay. Yes, I go for wedding reception. I have one on Saturday in the morning. Okay. I have in Lagos. That's, that's so I do wedding reception, but just that I'm not. Um, I mean, I'm strictly gospel. Okay. So when you see me, whatever I'm doing in church, the only difference in wedding is that it's dance, 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 dance. So it's a, a, a part of entertainment it and ministry. Sort of I know you have the, that's why they called you now. You make yeah. them dance, make them enjoy what they're <laughs> yeah. hearing. All right, conclusively. Uh interesting, you know, having a nice time with you on the show. Thank you. Okay.